With the amount of craft products launched daily, there really isn't a limit to your creativity. Best of it is, I get to do reviews on these products and share my experience with you. Hi, I'm Michelle Holthausen, editor and publisher of Creative Hobbies Magazine and Craft Studio. And today, I'd like to talk to you about Pilot's new fiber tip marker range called Pintor. So what makes Pintor unique? It actually allows us to work on multiple surfaces with one marker. You can now work on fabric, leather, wood, plastic, glass, to name but a few. You get a medium and fine tip and there's a wonderful array of colors to choose from. Today, I'd like to show you how to use the Pintor products on wood. I've chosen to decorate this wooden bowl and I'm gonna show you how to do that. What you'll need is a paper plate to ink the fiber tip, some sanding paper, a triangle out of cardstock, and then three different colors in the Pintor markers using the fine markers. The rough wood surface really eats away at your fiber tip. So to avoid that, sand the surface with your sanding paper. I've already sanded our surface, so we can just get started. If you haven't worked with Pintor's markers before, you need to ink the fiber tip first. Let me show you how to do that. On a paper plate, just tap away slightly so the fiber tip pushes in ever so slightly. As soon as the ink comes through, you know that your tip is inked. The next step is to cut a triangle from cardstock. This is just to get you in the motion. As soon as you've got a couple of lines, it'll be much easier to just do it by yourself and you won't need the template as much. There is no right or wrong with this design. The only thing you need to get right is the positioning of the paper. So make sure that your tip is in the middle so you can get a straight line going through. Continue in this manner until you're satisfied with the finished product. For more projects on Pinto markers on different surfaces, please go and have a look at our YouTube channel for Pilot.